What's up everybody, Gary Simon here. Today we've got another fun responsive design challenge. So yesterday I reviewed your simplistic responsive design submissions. And today we're going to increase the level of complexity quite a bit because you're going to run into this stuff. So this is what we're going to focus on right here. I designed this yesterday. This is just kind of like a fictional digital flight ticket essentially for like an airline passenger. And we can see it's kind of cool. It looks kind of like, I don't know, um, kind of like futuristic, if you will. And there's a lot happening here in terms of the content, uh, rows and columns, right? So your goal is to take this design and translate it from this desktop variation to a tablet right here and to a phone, all right? So the width of the card should basically match this grid layout right here from the very left to the very right. Um, I, you could toggle that off, of course, but make sure that's the width of this particular card. So obviously, um, when you import this entire element and you try to stick it over here, you're not going to have the room. So what are you going to do? Just try to scale everything down proportionally? I suppose you could do that, but I really don't, I would, I kind of don't want you to do that. You can make your font sizes smaller, but you really need to think about how you're going to adjust the layout and reduce the number of columns and collapse things into rows. And then you have the same task doing this over here as well. So it's going to get tricky. It might be difficult, um, but that's the point of this. So I won't be able to review every single submission, even if you get it in within a three hour window by 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time today. Um, because this is going to take a while. There's a lot more happening here. So I'll do my best to do as many as I can within a reasonable time frame. Um, in, in doing so, we should get a good idea. So when you do this, just try to think about your groupings, all right? Things that make sense to stick together, and you separate those with white space typically. So think about how you're going to do that. Get your submissions in, and I'll see you tomorrow with the review of these flight ticket cards. All right, everybody. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.